You can customize Draw.io in Confluence Cloud to use your corporate style by default. Once you have customized Draw.io, whenever someone drags a shape onto the drawing area, it will automatically follow your corporate style settings for colors, fonts, and more. For example, this is a diagram created using Draw.io's default style. All of the shapes are filled with white and have a black border that is one point thick. When you add some text or a label, it uses 12-point Helvetica font. To customize the Draw.io defaults and make it easier and faster for your users, you'll need to go to the Confluence settings in the administration area in your Confluence Cloud instance. Click on Draw.io configuration. Add your custom styles into this UI configuration field. Save the configuration once you have finished. Add your corporate font into default fonts. In this example, we've added the Leto font. Only the fonts that you include here will be able to be selected in the Draw.io editor. Make sure you list all of the fonts you want your users to be able to use. All the other default fonts you can normally select will be removed. Specify the default style for shapes in Default Vertex Style. This will be automatically applied to any shapes you drag from the shape library to the drawing area. In this example, we've customized the font, its size and color, the shape fill and border colors as well as the border width and rounded corners. You can see the code we've used to customize this in the YouTube video description. Now, whenever you create or edit a Draw.io diagram, you'll see the newly configured default style is used automatically whenever you add a shape to the drawing area. It has replaced the first style in the palette. Add some text, and you'll see it uses the new default font, and you can see the list of fonts has changed. But, customizing default styles doesn't just stop with shapes and fonts. Let's keep going. Back in the administration area, we want to set a new default connector style to be orthogonal. This makes sure the connector enters and exits a shape at a right angle. If the connector connects a shape to itself, the ends of the loop will also be orthogonal. We also want Draw.io to use the best jetty size by default. That's the length of the first and last segments of a connector when it joins a shape. Finally, let's round the corners of the connectors, set the color to orange, and make them two pixels wide by default. The code that we've used is also in the YouTube description. Back in the drawing area in Draw.io, whenever you drag a connector out from a shape, it will use the new style by default.